The world of hypercars is built on extremes. Every manufacturer that enters this rarefied space wants to push boundaries, whether it be top speed, acceleration, weight saving, or raw spectacle. Yet, when Koenigsegg unveiled the Regera, the automotive world stopped in disbelief. Here was a car claiming to take on, and in many cases obliterate, the greatest hypercars ever made. Without even having a traditional gearbox, for enthusiasts, the immediate question was, how can that possibly work? Gearboxes are the very heart of performance cars, dictating how power is delivered and ensuring that engines stay in their sweet spot. Yet Koenigsegg, a small Swedish company with a reputation for fearless innovation, threw convention out the window and proved that not only could you build a car without gears, but you could make it faster, smoother, and more thrilling than anything else on the planet. To understand why the Reg Era is so revolutionary, you first need to grasp what gearboxes actually do in traditional cars. An engine, especially a combustion engine, doesn't deliver its maximum power across the entire rev range. You need gears to multiply torque at low speeds and to maintain efficiency at higher speeds. That's why even the greatest supercars, from Ferraris to Lamborghinis to Bugattis, rely on intricate multi-speed transmissions. They're engineering marvels, but they're also heavy, complex, and filled with compromises. Each gear shift, no matter how quick, is still a break in power delivery. For decades, we all accepted this as an unchangeable truth of performance driving. Koenigsegg challenged that very assumption. The Reg Era ditches the gearbox entirely thanks to a radical system called Koenigsegg Direct Drive, or KDD. Instead of multiple gears, the Reg Era has a single fixed ratio between its massive twin-turbo V8 and the wheels. To make that work, it blends the raw force of the combustion engine with three electric motors. The result is instantaneous torque at low speeds, smooth and seamless acceleration through the mid-range, and devastating power at high speeds without ever needing to shift. Imagine flooring the throttle and never once feeling a jolt from a gear change. Just an endless, uninterrupted wave of power propelling you forward like a rocket. That's the sensation the Reg Era delivers. What's staggering is how much engineering it took to make this seemingly simple solution possible. Removing a gearbox is not just a matter of skipping a part. It requires rethinking the entire drivetrain. The electric motors aren't just there for efficiency. They are essential to filling in the torque gaps where gears would normally help. At low speeds, the electric motors provide immediate thrust, masking the turbo lag of the massive V8. As the speed climbs, the combustion engine takes over seamlessly, while the electric motors continue to assist as needed. By the time you hit triple-digit speeds, the V8 is pulling at full force, and because there's no gearbox, there's no interruption in power flow. It feels like being strapped to a jet engine rather than a car. Many skeptics initially assumed this was just a gimmick, a publicity stunt from Koenigsegg to differentiate themselves. But real-world performance figures silenced any doubt. The Reg Era sprints from 0 to 100 km per hour, 62 miles per hour, in under three seconds, an achievement plenty of hypercars can claim. But it's what happens after that that's jaw-dropping. The car goes from 150 to 250 kilometers per hour, 93 to 155 miles per hour, in just over three seconds. Then, from zero to 400 kilometers per hour, 248 miles per hour. It takes less than 20 seconds. To put that in perspective, the Bugatti Chiron, an engineering titan with a traditional gearbox, takes several seconds longer to reach the same mark. In the world of hypercars, those seconds are an eternity. The Reg Era doesn't just keep up without a gearbox, it leaves its rivals struggling in its wake. The elimination of a gearbox also brings massive advantages in weight and complexity. Hypercars often suffer from being over-engineered, burdened with heavy components that blunt their agility. Dual-clutch gearboxes, while fast and sophisticated, are also large, complex, and heavy. By removing the gearbox entirely, Koenigsegg cut weight and reduced drivetrain losses. This means more of the engine's brutal 1,100 horsepower, and the additional 700 horsepower from the electric motors actually makes it to the wheels. That translates into efficiency and performance gains that you can feel immediately. 
And while other manufacturers chase lighter materials or shave off grams from tiny components, Koenigsegg removed an entire category of hardware altogether. Driving the Reg era is unlike anything else. And that's not just marketing talk. Most high-performance cars remind you constantly of their mechanics. The sound of the gears clicking, the feeling of the clutch engaging, the kick of each upshift. With the Reg era, you get silence when you want it, violence when you ask for it, and always a sense of uninterrupted motion. It accelerates with a linear surge that feels alien compared to the stop-start rhythm of traditional cars. The irony is that Koenigsegg created one of the most extreme hypercars ever built, but also made it easier to drive. You don't need to worry about downshifting before a corner or timing your upshift perfectly. The Reg era simply delivers power as you demand it, no questions asked. For purists, the lack of gears might sound like sacrilege. After all, part of the thrill of driving an exotic car is the drama of shifting, hearing the engine scream as you click into the next gear. But Koenigsegg understood something deeper. True speed is about continuity, not interruption. The Reg era gives you something different. A futuristic thrill where the power feels infinite, where your connection to the machine isn't defined by clunky mechanical steps, but by a constant surge that feels more like flying than driving. In many ways, it's the purest possible expression of performance. It's also worth considering how the Reg era points to the future of hypercars. As the industry moves toward electrification, gearboxes will increasingly become relics. Electric motors don't need them. They provide peak torque instantly and across a wide range. The Reg era proves that even when paired with an internal combustion engine, you can eliminate gears and still dominate. In fact, Koenigsegg's solution may be a bridge between the old world of thunderous V8S and the new world of silent, electric hypercars. It combines the drama of combustion with the instant response of electricity, creating a template that others may follow. Yet, because Koenigsegg did it first and did it flawlessly, the Reg era will always stand apart. Perhaps the most remarkable thing about the Reg era is the boldness behind its design. Christian von Koenigsegg and his team didn't just want to build another hypercar to compete with Bugatti, McLaren, or Pagani. They wanted to rethink what was possible to take a risk that others wouldn't even dream of. Eliminating the gearbox wasn't just about saving weight or finding efficiency. It was a statement that the rules of performance driving are not fixed in stone. In doing so, they created a car that doesn't just destroy hypercars on paper or on the track, but one that redefines what a hypercar can be. In the end, the Koenigsegg Reg era is more than just a machine without gears. It's a proof of concept that shattered decades of automotive tradition. It showed the world that you can challenge sacred assumptions and come out victorious. Most people still can't believe that a car without a gearbox can outperform those with the most advanced transmissions ever built. But that disbelief is exactly why the Reg era is legendary. It isn't just another hypercar. It's a paradigm shift, and that's why it destroys every rival in its path. Conclusion the Koenigsegg Reg era shocked the world by proving that gears aren't necessary for mind-bending performance. Through radical engineering, seamless power delivery, and fearless innovation, it became the hypercar that rewrote the rulebook. In a world where even the best supercars cling to tradition, the Reg era dared to break free. And in doing so, it left the competition in the dust.